Uh, what's up y'all? Today we're doing rice balls. Now this is something that's a staple in our home. My homegirl Rika hooked us up. My homegirl Sandra hooked us up. She officially introduced us to it. Now we can't be without it. So this right here is about that food prep. It's real simple, real quick. Let me show you how it's done. All right, cool. So we already made the rice. We're taking the rice out. We'll put it in this wooden bowl. We want to break it up and just kind of spread it around so that the um, the heat can kind of come down. We want it cool. Definitely want room temperature. Um, and also this wooden bowl helps with the moisture. So excess moisture will be absorbed through the bowl. So this bowl right here is what's up. Um, Sandra's gonna show us what's up on this wrap that makes it really cute and fun if y'all wanna do it for your kids along with yourself. I mean, why not throw some excitement in the, uh, you know, in your food. It's those small and little simple things that bring joy to your life, right? Okay, so a uh, couple options I have here is something really simple. Um, I got a salmon packet. I got albacore white tuna packet. These are your quick grabs. I wanted this to be food prep that's real simple and easy that you don't have to fuss over cooking. This is one of those, man, I don't have a lot of time. Shoot, let me throw some stuff together so I don't set myself up for failure, right? So we're gonna go ahead. I also got some shrimp. We're gonna open up these packets. I'm gonna just put them in this container so I can portion, portion them out. What's important is you wanna make sure that um, if you're really dialing in your macros, you got your protein intake, your carb intake, as well as um, your fat intake dialed in. What's cool is you can measure that out and that could be in each individual rice ball or you can actually split it up into two rice balls if you're the kind of person that likes more portion. So it's kind of like psyching yourself out, right? All right, cool. So we got some tuna, we got some salmon, and the shrimp. All right, Sandra, will you show us um, how you'll do the rice ball to get that started with the cute little package? Yes. So first, you want to wet your hands before uh, they touch the rice. So it's not sticky. Scoop a little rice, scoop a little rice in your hand. What I like to do is to flatten it so it has room for whatever you are going to put inside. Dra, can you help me put some? Sure, what would you like, tuna or salmon? Uh, tuna. Okay, cool. Just put it in the middle of the rice ball and then screw some more rice on top of it. and then just make it into shape. Like that. Also, if you have rice seasoning, you can just um, dip the rice ball into the seasoning so it has some flavor on the outside. So this is the rice seasoning we have. You can just grab a plate and put some on the plate. Spread it out. And then grab the rice ball and just dip it. Like that. And then we have this really cute packaging here. Just open it. And just put it in like that. And usually the packaging comes with stickers. It's pretty easy. Ta-da. All right, so now I'm gonna show you another way that's really simple as well. So I have a bowl with some saran wrap. I'm going to put it together as if, you know, cause I'm focusing on my macros. I wanna make sure my protein intake, my rice intake is together. So I'm gonna take half of my portion size of my rice and put that inside that saran wrap in that bowl. Okay, then I'm gonna take, I chose, I want some shrimp. 
So I'm gonna just cut up some shrimp because I'd like to have a little bit more room. Plus when I go to eat it, I would like a bite of shrimp per bite. So I'm gonna throw that in there like that. Couple options, I have cucumber, which is a Japanese cucumber. It's not as soft in the inside, which uh, provides texture. I have some kale and some Brussels sprout mix that I you know, put in there as well. Um, I steamed that. I'm gonna go ahead and just put a little bit of bento flake inside that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add the rest of my portion of my rice. That. And then I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna grab the ends, bring that up to the sides. And then I'm gonna form that as well. Now my portion could size, this would be one of two. I just like to shape it a little certain kind of way, but it's up to you. It could be just a ball or like a little triangle. I'm trying to do it a little fancy. But however, whatever. That's my ball. Just like that. And I'm gonna put that in the freezer. All right, y'all. So the one that was in the freezer, you take it out. When you're ready for it, you can put it in the microwave um, just for a few minutes, possibly maybe even 30 seconds. Um, the details would be down below depending on the size of the rice ball. Also, um, you got this cute little package option, which makes it fun. As well as when you need that quick shot grab, go to your local Japanese market. They'll have them already pre-made. Um, the other option is you can wrap it in seaweed. Um, I didn't show you that option today, but it's really simple just to add that to the Senran wrap and then your rice and then do the forming just like we showed. All right, y'all, this is that quick shot meal prep option. That's delicious, tasty, you know how we do it. All right, make sure you subscribe. Don't forget, click the bell notification just so you don't miss out on these other videos that are coming your way every Monday. All right, y'all, mwah.